Also happening today, volunteers in public schools, they typically welcome students and teachers back on the first day of school, but obviously because of the pandemic this year, they've adjusted that welcome celebration to just teachers and faculty only. Fox 44's Courtney Williams is live this morning at Sherwood Middle School with more on the event that's happening this morning. Hey, Courtney. Hey, good morning to you guys. Well, still hanging out here at Sherwood Middle talking all about first day helpers. And here I have with me one of those partners, Cox Communications. And here I have with me Mr. David Dockin. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Thanks for having us. Thank you. So, kind of tell me a little bit how you guys, you know, got involved with VIPS. Well, we're proud to partner with VIPS uh, for their back to school event. You know, they do such important work in our community. Uh, they help more than 800 kids a year and they partner with uh, teachers and students. So we know they're a vital resource for our community. And we want to get them some supplies here to help for the first day back. Yeah, you definitely have a lot of supplies here <laughs> on the table. So uh, what else are you guys, you know, doing just to help out those, um, you know, school districts and everything in the community? We're working with school districts across the country and across the state because we want to make sure that we close the digital divide and have kids connected to the Internet. And we know a lot of families right now are struggling financially because of the pandemic. So we have a program called Connect to Compete. We've connected over 36,000 kids since the pandemic started to low-cost internet, and we have more information at cox.com slash connect to compete. Awesome. And how do you feel personally just to be involved in these efforts, especially during the pandemic? I'm inspired to be here. I mean, we were just talking about the school is filled with teachers, and they're all teaching in front of cameras right now, and there's 800 kids at this school who are all learning online. That's pretty awesome. It's, it's neat to see all this in action, and I'm inspired by educators every day. Awesome. And just what are you looking forward to, you know, as the school year gets underway, just seeing teachers, you know, utilize all the resources? Oh, well, we always want to make sure the teachers have the tools they need uh, to get their jobs done. We want to make sure that kids have the tools they need to learn successfully. And so we're going to continue to work with partners like VIPS and with the school to make sure that, uh, you know, uh, teachers and students have what they need and figure out where we can step in to help when necessary.